So here we are, C2, 500 meters. You can see the dimensions of the boat. And the Russians, well, even Shatil often comes through this, but he decided to go for a different event this time with Melentiev and Sherbata taking the place. Semensky Lubineski from Poland, former junior world champion Hadju and Fekete from Hungary, also having a good week with Janczuk and Mishtuk from Romania, Ukraine rather, putting forward some great results in the last two or three years. The Spaniards again, as we've just seen, having a, a cracking weekend so far. No rules to say you can both have to both have your blades on the same size, as we'll see a bit later. Some of the women don't. Carl Milachi again. These are all consistent medal winners. It's going to be a really fascinating competition. Erdon de Silva, Zacchaeus, Dos Santos, where we saw him on the first day taking out the gold medal of the 500 meters. Remember, he won three medals in Rio. Szyminski, Lubienski. Very versatile pair. We keep calling them young, but they're moving on in age a little bit now. The Hungarians. Really came into plan a couple of years ago. Cleaned up in the juniors. Yeah, and Chukamishchuk. Won quite a few races in the World Cup circuit in the last couple of years. Well, Olsen Kretschmer. The great tactics in the C2-1000. They actually won it, by the way. In the heat, they came sixth. They said that was our plan. They wanted to go through the semi-finals. Moldova, Spinachian and Nutter. They have good strength and depth. Say, so, 500 meters. Perfect weather conditions. See Spain, Romania, Russia, Brazil, Poland, Hungary, Ukraine, Germany, and Moldova. Good spread of nations taking the medals as well. It's great to see. Especially that's crucial for the Olympics. As we all know, for take a complete gender equality. starting lane, making sure they're steady and hold them as long as they like. And so far today, we've seen no false starts. And they're off all safely. Looks like at the bottom of the picture, the Moldova coming off to a cracking start. Germany just a little bit off the pace. Poland have the fastest start. How do they do this? Well, it's a spider cam. Four large cranes, 40 meters high. Russians, very versatile, can certainly switch boats. Gone off to a, a cracking start there. The Quiros of Santos, known for their very, very fast stroke rates. Great athletes moving ahead of Brazil. So, already half the race gone. Brazil from Russia, Hungary and Germany. These are the expected favourites. As you can see from the great overhead pictures, you have to be pretty much in the middle of your lane and you maybe need to correct that in lane number four. It is the Brazilians in your picture. Looks like they've decided to put on exhibition. They're really in the last 20 metres up the stroke rate and really pulling away from the others. Well, they're certainly not going to lack the stamina. These are young athletes on the top of the game. Prios de Santos and Erlan Silva had a great festival time in Rio. They're going to keep going into Tokyo, but they're actually making clear space. There's about 50 metres to go. Looks like they're enjoying themselves here. Brazil take the gold medal. Who's going to take the second? It looks like it's going to be ooh, just Russia. From the top of your picture, Romania might take the third. <laughs> Two girls. Zayek, Prios de Santos. and love to celebrate.
All the others are completely exhausted. And they're having a Four, fiesta. Three. Oh, five, that's really impressive. And one to the boat control. Four. Three. Ah! Five. And one. Up the straight rate at the right time and really took control of the race in the second half. As a case does fall out sometimes, so we need to be a bit careful about this. Famously in Milan, just coming to the line on a classic race against Sebastian Brendel, but this is impressive, isn't it? Over a boat length. Brazil from Poland. Brazil from Russia, though, sorry, that's what we said, from Poland. Time, if you're interested, one minute 40.043, so then go down to a thousandth of a second. Puts on the Shea. Two gold medalists so far. Here we go. Brazil take the gold, Russia take the silver. Poland take the bronze medal, champions C2, 500 meters, World Championships 2018. You follow your own favorites all the way down. You can see in the background, you can see those huge cranes, 40 meters high each. over to where the podium is and after the baits clearly have to go through boat control but they've had plenty of chances to test them for early in the day or in the week well, certainly a well-rounded athlete waiting to have a quick chat with the winners. Yes, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's another medal for Brazil. It's a golden medal for the boys in the C2 Men 500. Isaacias, Erlon, congratulations, world champions. Isaacias, what does it mean for you? Another, another world title. Muito obrigado. Estou feliz de ter conquistado mais uma medalha de ouro no meu país. C1500, C1000 e agora C2200, 500 com o Erlon. Dedicar essa medalha pessoalmente ao nosso treinador Jesus Morlan, que sem ele a gente não teria conseguido esse resultado. Fala para ele que o ano que vem, no C2000, a gente está aí para brocar. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for our gold medalists in the C2 Men's 500 from Brazil.